How would you like to get paid $55 an hour to learn data engineering? What's up? It's Andrew Baines from the Custom Journeys podcast. Uh, planning on dropping some new videos for you guys each and every week, just highlighting some unique opportunities within tech. Hopefully this will help you guys jumpstart your career or advance your career. So let's go ahead and get started. One of our most popular episodes to date features a gentleman named Mike Roberts based out of San Diego, California. He is the founder and CEO of an organization called Creating Coding Careers, which if you don't know, is a tech apprenticeship program that pays you $20 an hour to learn software development skills. Mike's interview was the very first one that introduced us to tech apprenticeship programs. Tech apprenticeship programs are great opportunities for you guys to not only learn new skills, but get paid at the same time so you don't have to go into debt uh, to learn a new skill. Basically, you're getting paid to learn. So I wanted to take a minute to highlight three unique tech apprenticeship programs that I think you guys should really check out today and take advantage of. But before we do that, I need you to do me a favor and hit the subscribe button below. Also, make sure you like the video and share it with a friend. I think this will add a lot of value to you guys. But let's go ahead and get into it. The first opportunity I want to talk to you guys is ran by an organization called OnRamp. Uh, it's actually in partnership between OnRamp and Vanguard, the company responsible for 401ks, IRAs, all that good stuff. So they are actually partnering together to offer a data engineering apprenticeship program that pays you $55 an hour. So this is by far the highest paying apprenticeship program I've ever heard of. And it's really great because it's also a remote opportunity. If you're interested in this role, a few skills that they're looking for you to have is familiarity with Python, SQL, AWS, and then also data analytics. And so by no means are they expecting you to be an expert, but they're expecting you to kind of come in already with a basic level knowledge, possibly have completed a coding bootcamp or an online certification of sorts. So if you've done that and you think you're a good fit, I highly recommend you apply. The deadline for this program is actually August 30th. So as of today, you have about two weeks. So you definitely want to make sure you take advantage of this program and also check the description below. I'll drop a link down there so you guys can apply. But yeah, great program overall. I highly recommend you check it out. Number two, the second program is another partnership, and this one is a partnership between Niantic, the company that is responsible for creating Pokemon Go, and a organization called Tech Elevator. So the unique thing about this is it's a 14-week free tuition coding bootcamp program for 20 applicants where they teach you software development skills, and then at the end of that coding bootcamp, they're going to place you either at a junior uh, software engineering role within Niantic or at a partnering corporation that works with Tech Elevator, and you'll be getting paid as a junior level full-time software engineer. The deadline for this opportunity is October 24th. And again, I'll drop the link in the description below so you can check that one out. All right, and then opportunity number three. So I found this last opportunity through a company called Multiverse.io. It's a tech startup company that is focused on apprenticeship programs both in the US and in the UK. So this role is actually provided by a company called Fiserv and pays $70,000. This role is actually based out of New Jersey, and it is specifically for individuals who are between the age of 18 to 26 who do not have a bachelor's degree. So those are some of the qualifications that you will have to fall within in order to apply for this particular role. But overall, it looks like another great opportunity for you guys if you're looking to get into tech and you're based out of the New Jersey area. So... I hope you enjoyed those three. Um, I will leave you with one bonus one. I recommend that you guys check out apprenticeship.gov slash finder slash listings. This is a great database that the U.S. government provides, a full list of tech apprenticeship programs. Some of the companies that I've been able to find on there are Lockheed Martin, Boeing, Bank of America, Cigna, and many more. So they have a full list of different tech apprenticeship programs based in the U.S. Highly recommend you guys check it out. Um, maybe check in on a weekly basis because they do update the list on there. And then last but not least, um, I want to try something different. I want to get feedback from you guys, not just in the comment section, but I want to hear about where you're at in your career, uh, what's your education level, your age, and what career you're hoping to pursue and really want to use this data to help us inform like what kind of content we want to provide and then also what kind of like virtual and in-person events uh, we want to start having and hosting for you all. So if you have a second, please take a look in the description one more time and complete the survey below. It would do us a big help if you can complete that. So please do that. And that's it. I hope you all enjoyed this video. 
Uh, if you have, please make sure you hit the subscribe button and also share it with somebody. Somebody, you have to know somebody who's looking to break into tech. So share this video with them. Uh, I hope it'll help them out a lot. And be sure to tune in next week. I uh, plan on making a little series out of this where every week I bring you new opportunities within the tech field. But yeah, that's it. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Um, I'll see you all on the next one. Peace.